This is the old um, Palladium, which is in Birmingham. Got some security cameras up there. Don't quite know what the deal is with those, but can you hold it a sec, mate. Can you hold this for us a sec? Just hold him a sec. Cheers, man. Let's get rid of this poop. Poop shit. For unfortunately, getting rained on, getting rained on. Here he is. Let's go. Bloody hell. So, there appears to be cameras here, but don't know if they're actually turned on or not. Don't care, to be perfectly honest. What care about is being rained on. Ooh. Okay, in here, down to the left, door has been opened for us. Arr. Arr. Jess, by the way. Oh, there's a sec. Woo. Here's one I prepared earlier. Le Jess. Thank you all. Thank you, thank you all. Use it. My phone screaming some sort of alarm at me. Right, let's turn the iris down. Focus. Are we recording? Yes, we are. Oh, we've got four hours and 25 minutes. Ah, shiz. Shizbot. Right, this is the Palladium. Shush phone. Shush. Shush. Close. Yeah. So, let's go and have a look at the uh, surrounding bits first. Oops, sorry, just clean us off some of this rain. Don't be getting in if I can help it. Right. Le toilets. Luckily, I don't need them today, so we're flying high. Oh, side door into the cinema and it has been used it appears as a church let's just have a quick look back here ah what's that room then doesn't mean a lot really but here you go this is it oops come on there we go so we have a very large very large ceilinged cinema building. And our ornate, ornate stuff on the ceiling. For some reason, there's a lot of ladders going to the windows. As you can see here, a ladder over there, and another ladder over there. Then we have what appears to be not just not just a cinema screen, although this is probably false. I imagine that's been put in later because it was probably too big. Maybe original cinema curtains or theatre curtains, but this might have been a theatre because it's got quite a deep, deep set stage. So it does go back a little bit. Ooh, so we got the old uh, Pigeon Central here. Pigeon Central, little uh, little alcove in here. Little alcove. It goes right up, right up there. Don't like the choice of wallpaper. Not very good. But this would have been the uh, congregation amassing in this area then. And yeah. So it does appear, look, there's the original 
There's the original archway. This has been built out in a false front being put on it. You can actually see, so if we look up here, we have an original, original features which have been hidden by this false front which they put on. So this is a false front here. Wow. That's the second nail I've nearly stood on today. I'm wearing trainers and uh, they don't have any protection on the sole. So I'm going to get some trainers that do. That's why I wear the boots, but the boots are too heavy. But it's well worth wearing safety boots because uh, I'll show you why now. Because I just stepped on that puppy. Not good. So. Uh, hmm. Let's have a little look around then. So we've got a mechanism here which looks like it would have been the uh, back. It's probably been ripped out, it didn't come from this position. But this is the mechanism for winding the winding the curtains open and close, either for the cinema or a theatre. It's probably an electric mechanism because there's a uh, power system going in there, but that would have probably been off that side, which is maybe what that hole is, you see. So that was there, and they've ripped it out. Over there is a lit, I was going to have a look at it now, a lit sign, a lit sign for the church to uh, let people know what's uh, going on. So we have uh, makeshift steps here and we have a uh, illuminated you can see they've done these cheesy switches on the side I mean how cheesy is that look how cheesy is that there's a lot of stuff on the floor with nails in it in this place I've noticed so I have to be careful um, a little room here doesn't seem to do very much. Possibly goes under the stair, uh, under the stage. We have an emergency exit on this side. It's dripping in a bit. An emergency exit of some description. Has it been walled up or something? Blocking the way. That is cobwebs. My god, look at the cobwebs. Look at that for some cobwebs. That is impressive. Look at that. That is wall-to-wall -wall cobwebs. Wow. That's been bricked up, so that's an old emergency exit. This has been, it's old toilets, but it's been screwed with a door on there to stop people coming in. And a metal door, which has been taken off. So that's, for some reason, people have probably got through there. So, wow. Let's, uh, let's see what we can see. This has been used for storage. There's a pallet lifter there. A lot of fluorescent uh, strip tape, chairs, fire extinguishers, which have been let off by the looks. A lot of old doors. I do like the features on the ceiling. There's actually still a bit of, uh, is that decoration or is it dropped through? No, it's just fallen off. It's fallen off there. Oh, and uh, up here, ceilings actually come down in a few places. And also there. So the ceiling has fallen in a bit. Somebody's been doing some uh, woodworking. There's a bandsaw here, an old bandsaw, somebody likes their fluorescent, fluorescent stuff is in here, old mattresses, a lot of old mattresses in fact, wheelie bins, office furniture, looks like this place has been used for storage of junk, lots of junk. So there's the side doors, which probably lead to upstairs or out to the front. And there are the doors on this side, let's have a look. Uh, it doesn't appear to be doors on this side. No. No doors on that side. Mm. So... 
Wow. So there's all washing machines, old cookers, house stuff. Down into the foyer area. Do you remember this foyer area? Come down these stairs. Oh, members' inquiries. Okay, thanks. Yeah, it's a lot of uh, broken bulbs. So more equipment. It's a vice. Vice and a. Uh, what you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, somebody's been doing work in here. And then uh, we've got, um, huh, isn't that a clamp off a car? That's a, a clamp to clamp somebody's wheels. I wonder why they got that in here. Wow, okay. Oh, this is the front door. Okay, there's, there's metal shutters down here. Metal shutters. I think, I think to be fair, Oh, that you could actually get in on the right hand side, look, if we'd gone over, look. Oh, or could you? Maybe there's a lock on the other side, but it kind of looks like it would let you in. I don't know. Don't know. Look at that. Maybe, uh, this mechanism here seem better to oh, for you. Yeah. Seem better days. It works a bit. Not a lot, but a bit. Ouch, I hurt my hand doing trying to do that. Whoa. So, what have we got then? Oh, that's a strange item. What's that? Oh, it's a flu vent. So this is where people must have paid for their tickets or cash here. Membership cards. Does look like a classic old window. Glass has slipped down a bit though. Yeah, glass has slipped a little. It's a fridge. Whoa. Step right in the glass, I wasn't meant to. <laughs> oh yeah, cool. Yeah. Telephones, seats. This is what it would look like when you're selling tickets to people. And a little back office. Small hmm. computer monitors. Wow, an old singer stitching thing. Wow, look at that. For those, oh, and the, and, the, and the sewing machine locked. It's an old singer stitching thing. Exit door, locks and chains must be kept here during opening club hours. So. Yeah, it doesn't really look like there's anybody been squatting this. It just looks like junk. Oops. Oh, more glass. Really should get. I really should get my boots. Oh, look, it's downstairs. Toilets underground. Underground toilets. Mad. Whoa, there's loads of clothing. Crap. Oh, that. I recognise that. That's just come out of my pocket. Great. That has just fallen out of my pocket. Like a moron. Just imagine if there was no more silly hat in my videos. Wow, look at this room. This is weird. It's quite a tall room. Yeah, it's quite a tall room. It's lots of uh, clothing. Like these, um, oh, can I get down here with the floor? Wow, that's quite tall. Doesn't really go anywhere, but it's tall. And that must have been a, an old emergency exit look. That's why that's here. That is why that is there. Whoa, he slipped. Um, it looks like clothing has been stored. 
the brand new body warmers and stuff in here. I know, I noticed that. It's like bags and bags of body warmers. There's all this sort of stuff. Loads of, loads of Harrington jackets and stuff like that. What, um, you mean body warmers? No, the ones with the, uh, you know, the red tartan on the inside. Is it? Down there, Daisy. Oh, I see. Lots of string. Hmm. Oh, and my camera's gone on the piss. It's back now. Red bug killer. Wow. So this is the first floor. And uh, what have we got here? Little room with a dark ceiling. For some reason, must be just equipment room. With doors, and we've got the windows to the outside world. Look at the spider at the top. Oh, where? Oh yeah. <gasps> oh, he's nasty. Nasty, nasty. Is he alive? <laughs> yeah, he's alive. It's all messed up from the outside. Bigger room. Oh, this looks like this projectionist room. This is the projection room. Here you go. But it appears like they've put a false wall in there and sealed up. So, sealed up. So there's nothing they can see through. But this would have gone straight through. They had one, two projectors. Two projectors, two room two doors into the room, an event up there, now what's on this side of the room, not a lot, just goes up a bit, the equipment here, and equipment here, projectors coming back away, but not able to see into the hall, so we'll look out for the false wall they put in there when we go back down. A look at the false wall. Ah, oh, this looks like a possible little secret way up to the secret way up to the uh, the roof, perhaps. I don't think that's going to be open, is it? Oh, it, oh my God! Wow. There's a draft. There's a draft. So let's go and have a look. What's in here? Oh, it's a it's full emergency stairs. All the way down and up. Uh, let's go up. Why not? Shall we? As an American guy says, join me, shall we? Oops, that's the door slamming behind me with the wind. So this goes right up. This goes up and up and up. This is quite something. It goes up again. Look, we're out looking outside of Birmingham now. And that's the uh, post office tower. This goes right the way up. Why so high? Why so high? And it goes up again. This is crazy high. Not even the projectionist was this high. What's up here? Why does it go so high? Oh, this is to, this is to the seats. I'll show you in a sec, but there's a side of the window, but here we go. Here we go. But before we do, what's in here? Oh my God. Oh my God! You can go up to the you can go up to the roof, right? That's that's going to be a secret treat for later on then. Wow! Exploring with KMK. <laughs> Exploring with KMK. I wonder if I got a sticker. In my wallet. Let me see if I got stickers. I think I have actually. Have I? Have I? I have. I got some stickers, look. Oh, it'd be rude not to, wouldn't it? I used to say, where have you been here? I wonder what company this was then. It's got something written on the back. Minerva Accord. Minerva Accord. So, would any of my stuff really stick on the wall here? I don't know. 
Let me see if I can get it off. Is it going to stick on this wall? I don't think so. That's, that's absolutely minging wet, that wall. So, it's very solid here, these steps. Let me just sort myself out a second. Folks, we need to find a wall that isn't wet for this. Uh, maybe the projection room I think is better for this, but let's come back in a minute. Let's have a little look what we got down here. So, first off, we've got the seats. We've got a Sam and Jess. It's very solid, there's no bounce here at all. Very solid construction. I like cinemas like this. Look at the old fashioned seats. Look at that. Wow. Hang on, I'm just going to change my, uh, my colour balance a sec. So, yeah. So we've got seats and seats and seats. And <laughs> that's a bit of a hazard look. They've got these uh, these little nodules sticking out the side that you can whack your whack your legs on. But now you get a sense of the uh, the decor in here. Look at this. Attention to detail going up, and there's no joins. You know, this is all continuous. So that means that they may have had to, you know, dress it. So. Um, and continue it on because those are big pieces. So, and it going all the way along the edge, right down the front, right across there. Actually, looking a lot whiter there than on the ceiling. But uh, have a look at the uh, the nice uh, ceiling reliefs as well. You can see the uh, ceilings come down a little bit. Wow. So it's a bit, uh, it's a bit drier down here. So I may, may Whoa, nice. Look at that's peeling up. It's not having it at all. No. No. <laughs> it might be sticking there, but it's only through moisture. Might, might stick that in the, uh, Look at that though, that's just amazing. I love that. Wow. And all the way down to the cinema screen. So, are we looking? No uh, cap on the lens, no, we're good. We are good. So, there we are. Now we've got two ways. In and out. So that's minor stairs, and it goes to nothing. And that's a minor stairs. Check those out in a minute. We've got another stairs on the other side, and a fire hose reel. But, uh, Go out to the roof. Uh, this is just Oops. There is a way to the roof on the right-hand side. It goes to the. Uh, it goes up into the into the crawl space, the catwalk, which I'm not going to attempt. But uh, yeah, but you can see catwalk. There's walks there, but they're wooden. Oh no, wooden no, wooden no. Okay, look at this one then. This is the god, the god walk. Are you ready? The god walk. Wow. Okay, this is it. It's what you came here for. It's what you came here for. Bird cage of the cinema. And the god, the god walk of terror. Wow. 
Would we be insane to try and walk this? There's metal. So, if we were to... It's dry. It's dry. It is very dry, but, you know, we've got wooden struts on the left and right. I did say I wasn't going to do this, but it looks so dry up here that I think it might be doable. Look at this. Winch. Look at the winch here. Wow. That would have gone through there, through that little hole, to winch up a light or something. Oh, look at the, look at the hole. <laughs> Whoa. Oh my god. This is the catwalk, folks. Do we really want to be doing this? Don't get too close. We don't want too much weight in the same place at the same time. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. This is nuts. On a scale of 1 to 10, how nuts would you say this is when the ceiling's falling through a look? There's a pigeon up there. He's like, hello. Hello. Why are you doing my house? It's my house. You get out. I call police. Now, it's a bit damp at the bottom of the catwalk here. It's a bit damp at the bottom. But I don't know. Let's have a look. What have we got? Oh, we've got more catwalk. Wow. This goes down and out to the end. So, this is really long. So, here we go. We're all the way out and along in the ceiling. Can you see the curve of the ceiling as it goes off and around? And it goes off and down over there and down. This is nuts. I have to be careful here because this is damp. So I may step over this bit. Step over this bit. But, uh, this is just wood we're standing on now. The catwalk is on wood, the ceiling is wood. Everything's just wood. Okay. Now, this is metal, so this isn't going anywhere. But, wow. It's quite well constructed, all things considered. It is fairly solid. And you've got uh, little baby catwalks. Now you'd have to be insane to walk along there. Right over the edge, look, down, drops over the edge. You'd have to be mental. But what if we go along here? What if we go along here? I know. Just, um, Keep some distance between us, yeah. just in case something happens. Wow, look at this. This is the crazy place. Look at that hole down there. I, I ain't even kidding, right? That, that's like a hell of a drop down there. It's a hell of a drop. And we've got more lifters, more pulleys to lift the lights up. Probably if they need to change the bulbs. So, wow, insane. We, you have to be insane to do this sort of stuff. And there's a, a little ladder, and then it comes out and goes out to a little window at the back, out to God knows where. God knows where. But there you go. Birmingham. I can feel it bouncing. Feel the ceiling bouncing. So we are just literally on above the above the ceiling space. Can you see it folks? Look, that's just crazy. So I feel better when I'm holding one of these like this. Does. Oh, my my exposure was up to three. That's not good. We slightly overexposed this. Uh -huh, we've got all the weight in one space here. Obviously confident.
wait in one space of the ceiling. Whoa. And uh, there we are, that's the ceiling. Big old, uh, big old vents there. It's hard to know why some of those bits of ceiling came down. It might just be old age. Could be drips have dropped in and caused problems. But uh, don't want to, don't want to risk too much uh, weight or hanging around. But there we are. I said I wouldn't do it, and I did it. Maybe because you can't actually see the drop beneath you. It's, it doesn't make you feel so bad, but... Huh, look down there. There's the, there's the drop. So why does my lens look so steamed up? It's not steamed up, really. Maybe the sensor's steamed up. Hang on. So... Serious yep. So look at the uh, all the iron bars go to a single point. It's like a cathedral type effect. All the bars coming down. It, it makes it. Uh, it's a multifaceted end as well. It's got ends to the building like multifacets. So. Whoa, wow. Whoa, cobwebs. No, cob... Whoa. I felt myself going then. I literally felt myself like... Like whoosh backwards, like my balance went. That was weird. And I, and I thought it was because the floor was going. <sighs> yeah, I looked up. That was the problem. I looked up. That messed with my head. And then I thought the catwalk was collapsing for a split second. Yeah. Whoa. Yep. Let's do it. Steep steps we've got here. Properly steep. Yeah. Look at that. That's a bit of class. Now we're onto stone now. These are stone. Nice handrail. I swear it looks so mushy. My image is just mushed. I think it might be some sort of steamed up sensor? Really? It's been in the car for a bit. I think my sensor's steamed up or something. Wow. Whoa, some nice uh, breeze coming in from there. Can you, can you just hold on to this a sec? Just, just hold that. Put this on. No, 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 it just looks milky. Anyway, okay, maybe it's my imagination. Oh, it's much better now. Maybe it just had a little bit of air in there. It's cleared it right up. It must have just been whoosh, you know, just took the took the, the creaminess off it. So, hey folks, you just got a, like a soft focused effect, which is uh, some people pay money for, but you know, you get it on the secret vault. We don't charge you anything for these filters. But it uh, wasn't intentional, but now we're back to sanity, focus. So, window, which is, uh, oh, doesn't look like it wants to open anymore, but it's got stained glass in it. So this goes down to a basement toilet, I think, as well. Did you notice there was yeah, a... Yeah. Haven't quite gone down there yet. No. I think it'd be rude if I didn't leave a sticker in the projection booth, though. Projection booth is uh, lower than the upper floor. Because the upper floor comes down and the projection booth is beneath it going down to the screen, which is... You don't always get that. So... Here we've got the door in, 
which we came in through. We could go all the way down. I'm going to leave my thing. Is this nice but moist? I'm going to leave it in the. Oh, I'll leave it in the projection room because that's my my favourite place. Oh, it's just wet in here as well. Everywhere's wet, moist. Got to be somewhere we can stick it. Sticky, moist, moist. Tell you what, look. I'm gonna dry that. Dry it, dry it, dry it. Dry it. Oh, the secret vault. Try and stick it on. No, it's still slipping. Still slipping. Still slipping, but you never know, it might stick. Given a bit of time. A secret vault. So, we can go down the steps there and they go down to the basement. Or, we can fully, I think, I think those ones do over there. But if we go down these ones first, we'll come back up again and then down to the basement section. So. Players number six cigarettes. Ah, emergency exit or side doors. You want to leave? Oh, there's no way. Doesn't go anywhere. Okay, well, that didn't work out. Whoops, that's easy. Piece of wire, just trip me up. So that's emergency exit only then. So the main thoroughfare, so that's why that was locked, it was from the top down only. It wasn't to be used as a general thoroughfare. And these would have normally been locked then. Do they work? Yeah. Mechanisms gone. But, uh, this was how it would have been in the day. That was locked up projection room. So we've been up that way. That's the stairs. And I think that's the way. No, it's not that's not the way. Yeah. Not the way. Well, so is it down there? I think. Yeah, there we go. It's not the way. More of these. Uh, there's lots of these things here. What's this underneath? Bitumen waterproof adhesive. Empty. Ha! Huh, belts. Belts. And belts and belts and belts. Belts and belts and belts. Wow. I've never seen so many belts outside of, outside of a place that, that maybe deals with belts. I don't think they fit around my waist. I was just say 26. They're all too small. 26, 26, 26, 26, 26. Wouldn't Did you guys go in the part where someone had been living? No. Yeah. Somebody living here? There's like two sort of bedrooms and a few stuff. Whoa. Does it look yeah, recent? Yeah, we watched it past it. Um, not super recent, but yeah. Okay, well as you can see, we've got more belts and more belts. So if we can get past the belts, we're going to go into the basement. A sneaky room in here. Yeah, it's like... How many belts? 24, it's even smaller. Look, could you get that around your waist? That's like, that's like tiny, tiny. No. No. Yeah, who has a, I guess the middle of the body. The middle of the body. Maybe around there, Ah, floor polishing, floor polishing stuff. This is that stuff you put on the floor to wheel your wheelie chair on. There's loads of 3M things here. What are these in 3M? Are these just polishing? Do they come in these boxes? Yeah, look. 3M polishing. 
discs. Brand new. Yeah, brand new polishing discs, loads of them. Cleaning equipment, cleaner's toilet back here probably. Cleaner's toilet. Wow. This is a secret little room. This this is the oh this is the male toilet, isn't it? Oh uh, yeah. Yes, it would have been the male whoa. Keep it collapsing into into uh, boxes. And yeah. Wow! Goes off. It goes off. <laughs> this might have been uh, vending equipment or maybe dishwashers, maybe. I don't know. Whoa, cobwebs nearly up my head. You see those? Look at those. So, watch your cobwebs. Ugh. Stinks of, stinks of pee down here. That's a. Uh, is that a pol That's either a polisher or that's a um, lawnmower. Yeah. Stinks of sewage down here. Oh, it doesn't go too far. It doesn't go too far. Oh, these are boilers. Sorry, they're not washing things, they're boilers. There's several boilers down here. And it just goes up to a little space. And that's it. And. That possibly could have gone out to the street level, and it may have been a coal bunker because it's angled. So it's a coal bunker. This was the boiler room, and then they had boilers down here, so that makes sense. Whoa. I know it does, doesn't it? That's the uh, thing off the mower. It doesn't really look used. Well, actually, no, it does because there's bits of grass in it. It's, it's pretty right good, those, pretty good condition. Well, <laughs> yeah, pretty good condition if you don't mind. A slight reassembly will be required. Lots of um, paints. Phew. Phew. If I was tripping on acid and walking up here, it'd be like Raiders of the Lost Ark. It'd be like uh, Indy in the snake pit. No, <laughs> yeah. oh, I don't like snakes. Whoa. So, there we go. There we go. I don't know if there's uh, much else to see now. Exploring with... Exploring with Yank. It's all wet in here. You can't really stick anything in. Did you in the There's no doors over this side. Mm. Apart from the front entrance, which is locked. Payphone and maybe a gent's toilet on this side. Did you say there was a bloke who'd be living in here? Oh, look, it's a kiddie's, um, kiddie's jacket. So what was down here then? So does it go downstairs? It does. Hard stuff. Ah, that was easier. Just push, push the doors up. So it does go down the other side, under, underground. Whoa. Did you go down? No. It looks like it goes further back, this one. Hmm. Careful, because it's all sharp. Sharp with some metal, one of four. Whoa. So I'm going to hold on. Whoa, sorry, folks. I don't know what I did then. Yeah, hang on. You want to film the ceiling. It's all bits of metal here, so I'm dangling, dangling down. Stepping down. Whoa. They are sharp as well. Ah. So this has a ladies toilet with a self-closing door. Two two cubicles downstairs. The self 
closing door still works. Oh, and that's just a dead end. Um, there they go. And more of these. Oh, is it? Is it full of uh, cobwebs? They got loads of these uh, little bins. These bin things. You know, quite, quite fun. Quite fun, funky bins. Why is my light not quite? There we go. Okay. So nothing, nothing too amazing. Oh, look at this old phone. Do you remember making calls on this, this phone? Give me some help, Brian. Kids, kids today don't even know how to operate these phones. <laughs> so, that's a... Uh... That's about it, I think. There's uh, not much else to do, unless there's something behind the stage. Oh, there's a bin here full of, whoa, fluorescent jackets and cups and saucers. And more belts. Cinema of belt snakes. Did you say there was a mm -hmm. somebody's up? Yeah. Up. Oh, we must have missed that then. Yeah, I walked straight past it. Okay. Uh, hang on, can I get to the top of the room? Yeah, let's get it there. Wow. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. Whoa. Mysterious room. The trousers keep falling down. I'm gonna have to stop. It's funny actually, I do I do need a belt, but there's no Belts in my size. Oh my god, here we go. Can you hold this a sec? Oh, yeah. Literally, my belt is falling off on my trousers. Needs to fold out bed. Cheers, man. It works. Fold out bed. See if we can see any evidence of uh, last time in here. Oh, date? This is 15th of April. This year. Did it say which year? No. No, okay. Somebody's clothing. That old coke bottle. Oh yeah, old coke. And look at the uh, look at the nice design in the window. Oh, yeah. See through to the street there. The floor's peeling up. There you go. That's uh, that's the, the back of this. It's got a yellow pen. Is that a yellow? Yellow pen, look. Weird. It's um, nail clippers without the clippy bit, the uh, the handle. More trousers. Seems weird to leave leave lots of pairs of trousers and stuff. He's got plenty of belts. Look, look, he's got. He's got <laughs> yeah. I wonder where he got that belt from. Hmm. <laughs> Couple of pairs of trainers. They look pretty clean, those trainers. They do, very clean. I think they've been eaten by a rat up on the back. Oh, food, yeah. What's this? Quickies. 
quickies. End something sold cash. End sold cash. Any line, any two line full house total. Oh, that must be for bingo. Bingo hall stuff. Oh. 2018, this is on that. 2018, okay. So, yeah, not too old then. Not too old. Yeah. Is this the only room up here? Next one, two oh, the bedroom. What's that? Okay, it's a beagle. That's um, something from a newspaper, isn't it? Yeah. Isn't that Andy Cap or something like that, was it? Andy Cap? Am I wrong? It's Andy Cap's dog or something. It's from a newspaper. Wow. That's pretty interesting. Well, that's a big headboard for a bed, isn't it? Yeah. What the hell? Is that a roulette table or a bingo table or something? Hang on. Is it? It looks like. It looks like. Wow. Yeah. Something going on here. Oh yes. It's a. Look at that. It's a poker table, or a some sort of blackjack table. Who'd have thought that? Wow. What type of game is this, folks? I have no idea. I don't gamble. But that's in here. That's a, this is like a secret room. Let's have a look. Secret room for the vents. It goes out over there. It's vents. I'm not going through there. It's Spider Central. Oh. Uh, there's lots of these red coats. Are these to do with um, people that would work here? Like red coats for the for the staff? Oh yeah. Yeah, this might be the original Yeah, original four in the house. Original four. So these belts have been making all their, their way all around the building, look. It's like a belt. Hmm. Okay, so... Oops, Daisy. Oh, it's another room, yeah. What are those? Yeah, It's a floor polisher. This is a blend of calamari. Floor polisher. It's been ripped apart. That's an old, old one, probably. Old polisher. Oh, Masons. God, it smells bad there. Mm -hmm. Right in this area. Let me know. God, yeah, it stinks. It's like musty. Without that, <sighs> so that's that then. A secret bit that we nearly missed. Secret bit. <sighs> Oops. We've got a window out here. Look to the Sikh temple. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Hello, what the Sikh temple, eh? Right next to the Sikh temple. Wow. And there's a big road. So, see the Sikh temple, yeah? Uh, I assume this goes up to the seats then. This is over the other side, so. Yeah, that's back where we were. Oh. That looks like somebody's neck neck brace for them if they had a neck injury. Did you see those toilets? No, I didn't see these. <laughs> Step up toilets. Let's have a look then. Step up toilets. That's weird. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, it's pigeon pigeon central. 
We've got a uh, toilet there. Unusual step design. They've utilised various layers and heights and this is a high ceiling. Wow. Bit of uh, mould and stink. The pigeons in there. Okay. Well, let's head on back down. I think we're almost done now. Not much else. Down. Oops, glass. So it's probably back up here and out. Did you check out behind the stage? I don't know if there is anything, is there? I don't know, no, I haven't looked. Yeah, I don't know. And uh Whoa! Is that my light? My light's just gone out. Oh, you bugger. Well, I think that's it, folks, because that bulb's that not bulb. Use this one for I'll put my head torch on. Now, one. One. Ah, that's gone now as well. Are you kidding me? Hang on. Ah. No way. Hang on. I have another torch in my pocket. Pull that one out. Right, can you hold on to the... Sorry, normal programming will resume. When Matt can get his torch on his head. Right. This, one, this one's cold and won't come on. Hang on. Nope, that's saying... It's, got, it's giving me a little bit of power, but not a lot. So, yeah, okay. Let's see if there's anything behind the stage then. I wonder if this thing works, like the lift, oh hang on. Face down. There we go. I wonder if this thing works. Yeah, look, it lifts up. It lifts up. So it's a pallet lifter, I think they call them, isn't it? Can't believe all my lights have died. Glad you got yours. You're down to bloody phone phone lights. So that doesn't go anywhere. I've tried that way. And that one over there. I don't think that goes anywhere. So yeah, the uh, uh can't see it, but um the projection booths must have been they were up there. Let me open my iris. There we are. Projection booths would have been there for the... Because that's a high... That is really high. The seats in the gods are really high. And that's why the projection booth was there. Because they were so high. But uh, I don't think there's anything over that side, but yeah. Oh, well. I think that's going to have to be it. Because of the shortage of lighting so let's get my hat which I ooh, nearly lost and uh, just say the goodbyes so this has been the Palladium it's been the Palladium in Birmingham and uh, hope you've enjoyed it Sam and Jess check out their Instagram Instagram is it? Instagram, Instagram. so check out their Instagram and I'll try and remember to put the thing in the link and uh, goodbye